Hello ladies and gentlemen, Isocrass here and welcome back to a brand new episode of Rust. The survival is weird. So, in the last episode, if you guys didn't know, I was basically dying from the cold and I still am. Not a problem that's been solved, but I do have some bandages and I am building up some, a more, like, a larger repertoire of basically clothing to wear whilst I'm running along this frigid highway. Hopefully, we get past wherever it is we need to go, otherwise we're going to be in deep trouble, especially with our sincere lack of food anymore. Ooh, hello. Where are we? I have no idea, but there is some more- Yay, chocolate! Yum, 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 yum. More water and more tuna. Anyway, in this episode, I do sincerely hope that we will be able to find ourselves a location to live! Because that's kind of important, honestly, is, uh, let's go ahead and grab this. We're just going to drain- this dry, okay, we can't drain it anymore, eat that, and there we go, just basically gathering up some health. We are going to try and find somewhere to live, somewhere nice and warm and away from these frozen, frigid highlands, because, yeah, we really cannot last here too much longer, can we? So without further ado, let's finish, we're just basically just crafting a basic repertoire of items for us to run around in, stuff that basically will let us survive a little bit better in the wasteland, i.e. leather clothing that'll stop us from freezing to death. You know, just, just average, everyday, necessary stuff. Uh, let's get rid of that sulfur, we don't need that just now, we will keep the metal ore though, and there's our gloves, awesome. So at a mild negative five degrees, we find ourselves traversing the wasteland once more. Hopefully to find somewhere that will be a little more gentle to us and a little less of a arsehole. Also, I, I do like to point out that we have somehow ended up back up to the looting area. Yeah, don't, 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 don't ask me how. I, I didn't mean it. It just kind of happened. I promise you that we're not going to go in there and loot. Okay. Me oh. Oh, well, no, definitely not friendly. <laughs> God damn it. Well, uh, you got me good, sir. You got me good. I'm a new player, Yo. just running around. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. thank you. <laughs> Do you mind if I heal up? Can I, can I heal up? Or are you, here, here, let me heal up. Okay. Do you want my gun, by the way? I found a gun in there. Dangerous area. I, I am, I am. Do you want my it's gun? Dangerous area, man. Oh, oh, oh. What, the gun? I, I found a gun in that area. I'll, I'll pay you the gun to lead me out of this cold wasteland. You know Biggie? Uh, who? This guy, Biggie. He he lives around this place. Oh, no. I, I'm brand okay, new on the server. doesn't matter. Dude, which gun, which gun, which gun, which gun? It's a bolt rifle. Well, I don't need Okay, fair it is. Uh, alright. I'll be on my way, though. Thank you very much. Yo, dude, I need your wood. You need my wood? Yes, I need wood. Uh, that's all I have. It's 99, so... Shit. <laughs> Sorry, man. Have a good day, though. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> oh my god, we almost died! <laughs> Thankfully, that person was nice. Um, but yeah, we, we lost a rock. Uh, we, we lost, yeah, we'll, we'll build a bone club for now. We need something that we can hit stuff with, but, man! Thankfully, he was friendly. If he wasn't friendly and just decided to execute us there, oh, <laughs> that would have been run over. Dang it. We gotta be more careful. I, I was like, I, I was trying to be friendly. I was teabagging him like, yeah, bro, I'm over here. It's uh, it's all good. And he, he was just, bang. <laughs> Single shot, straight to the head. Gotta give him props for it. Oh, it's a horse! Oh, oh, that's more food. That's more food. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, Damn it! Okay. Wow, we got him. We got him. We got him. Okay, he's almost down. Oh my god! I'm running! No! Oh, we can't afford to lose this. This is. Oh, man. Sometimes food just refuses to die. What on earth is happening here? Hello. Is that a repair bench? Oh, can we repair this? All right, let's have a look. So we need 50 cloth and 150 wood. We can get that. Oh, we can easily get that. Awesome. And we are back to lower grounds. Finally, out of the desolate wastelands are the snowlands. 
we have made it to somewhere where we can actually hopefully get a relatively good living off of let's uh let's put some distance between ourselves and this place that swap person relatively friendly even though he shot me in the face i'm quite happy he didn't finish me off <laughs> god damn it man that was rough so now it's just a case of keeping our eyes out making sure nobody's following us are we Oh, no way. Did we just do a huge circle? Please tell me we didn't. If there's a beach up here, I'm going to be mad. Hulk going to be very, very, very bugger. <laughs> hey, guys. Welcome back to the beginning of the series. Where we're going to cross over this lake and uh, cross over this damn river and leave and never come back. That's a bear. Oh, that's a bear. Oh, okay, let's stay as far away from that bugger as we can. Honestly, for as good a start as we've had, a lot of uh, interesting and unfortunate things have happened. Hi, horsey. Hit the bear. Okay, uh, I thought it was out of ammo there. Yeah. Nice. Okay. A lot of interesting and unfortunate things have happened. But thankfully, we are still pulling on through. Can I have my arrow back, please, horsey? Thank you. Can't get the other one back for whatever reason, but it's fine. I like how horses still give you chicken, though. <laughs> Just chicken. It's great. So, what we need to do now, and this is kind of a key objective here, is grab ourselves some stone and make ourselves an axe. Because, yeah, definitely in desperate need of some kind of tool that's better than a bone club. I mean, as good as bone clubs are, you know, it's not quite, not quite a touch on actually having something that you can chop wood with. Oh man, you can definitely tell the server's been up for a while. There are buildings everywhere. It's gonna be hard to find somewhere where we can settle down in peace and quiet, but it'll be alright. Ah, fuck it. You can live, pig. You can live. You can't, though. Hi, piggy. <laughs> I heard a gunshot. I definitely heard a gunshot. And that's the problem with a series like this. I don't know how long it's gonna last. Now, I don't even know if I'm gonna get a base built. Yeah, I could I could get shot and killed right now, and there's very little I can do about it. It's 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 yeah. Difficult. <laughs> I chose a server with some people on it because I felt like it would be boring to do it with no risk. But as you can see from our first play ever player interaction, yeah, this isn't exactly the nicest of places. I can't believe I can break a tree with a bone club. That's just straight up impressive. Anybody who can do that in real life, if you send me a video of you doing that, I will, I, I will, I will, I, I, I will give you a shout out. I will scream your name from within my garden. <laughs> okay, maybe not quite stream, but you know. Look how nice this place is. Uh, uh, nope. Okay. Okay. Noping, noping all over that. I really hope that bear doesn't just come charging through those bushes, nibbling on my giblets. Oh, let's just grab some stone and get the hell out of here. I don't like these woods anymore. Guess who found a box? What's in here? Uh, nothing. Okay, cool. Guess who found nothing useful? That would be me. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha. Oh. Oh, that was, that's really close by. I don't like it. Oh, whoa, whoa, hi, hi, I'm down here, down by the beach. Hello. <laughs> hey, please don't hurt me. What, where are you going? Hey, bro, down here. Bro? Oh, okay, bye. We should, re we should really count our blessings there, honestly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, right, second player we've interacted with. Not so friendly either. I don't think. Just keep our club out. <laughs> our our blood covered human bone club. They'll totally be friendly with me if I'm wielding this. Oh man, I really don't like this. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're good. It's okay. It's okay. I really don't think he was friendly. I really don't. I shouldn't have shouted. Why did I shout? I I thought you know maybe if I said hey I'm down here he'd be all like yeah. You're how are you doing? It's cool. It's cool, bro. Just, you know, move along. No, he was hunting me. Ah, uh, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, uh, okay. Well, we have found a building. Let's take cover in here real quick. And what is this? Hello. Who are you? 
Filling and unfilling. I have no idea what you are. But we have found ourselves a building which we're going to real quick commandeer for our own uses. This is this is actually not too bad a building. If we can put a front door on it and get some kind of lock on the go, it'll be good for like just coming and going for now and living in with a repair bench as well. <gasps> Do we have enough? Oh, we're missing 10 cloth. 10. Can we like repair it a little? No. Okay, we need we need that additional cloth. Dang it. But yeah, so um, not too bad a place to hole out for now, especially since it's got one of those. Let's go ahead and hook ourselves up with a door. A door is definitely going to be important. Where is the door? Um, door. We just want a normal door. Please. Please. Just a normal door. Why? I don't know. I, it's an alphabetical order, so. Um, yeah, it's, there's no door. Maybe W? Maybe for W for wood? Uh, there is wooden door. Wood, wood, wood door. We need 300 wood for it. Okay. We do have a hatch in there, though, which is quite helpful. Uh, let's poke our head up here. I don't see that guy. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Okay. Alright, let's grab a couple more arrows, and then we're gonna head back. Whoa, whoa. Okay. Don't do that to me, game. Let's grab a couple more arrows. Oh, we don't have any stone. Oh. Do you have anything in you? Nope. Do you have anything in you? Nope. They, they literally looted this place dry, didn't they? Still have no idea what this is. Um. Yeah. <laughs> it's a campfire, apparently, but I don't know what it does. Eh, okay, whatever. Don't see any enemies. We need to keep this place in mind. We're gonna go out and hunt down some animals, but we also need to be careful that we don't get stomped on by dickhead McGee here. Ooh, this could be bad. Oh, an animal. Okay, it's a deer. Uh, boom. Oh, okay. We just need 10 cloth. That's it. 10 cloth. Ah, we got 10 cloth. Okay, we're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. Run. Run. Okay, we're good. We're good. We got some chicken as well, which is very helpful. Oh, god dang it. Okay. The building is blocked here. Now, I've, like, I'm, I'm just noticing that, which means that we can't actually build here anyway. Unless we can find the cupboard. Uh, okay, no, stop that, please. Stop it. Thank you. Okay. And we need to head up to the top. Please. Please. Stop it. Just slow me up. Thank you, Dangus. And you yep, in there. Repair. Bam. Bam. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a fully repaired bolt-action rifle already. Wow. <laughs> that's, that's, that's amazing. Like, uh, I'm glad we didn't give this away to that person because then we wouldn't have this moment to, like, savor our awesomeness that we've survived not one, but two people and now have ourselves a fully operational bolt-action rifle before we've even built a base. Before we even found a proper location for a base, although I'm really digging this sort of area, all we need to do is clear out that guy over there and we'll be good to go. Clearing him out might not be as easy as we would like, though. What we could even do is we could commandeer one of these, like, abandoned buildings and sort of use it for our own gain. Now, obviously, we'll need to have full access to the cupboard in the back and it needs to have all its doors blown off. That's the stipulations for it. Otherwise, it's gonna be a little problematic. But what we could also do is we could find a massive base, like somewhere out in the wilderness, that has been completely raided, and then just put a couple of locked doors on it. Sort of like this. Yeah, so it looks like it's been raided, but then put a locked door on it. And what that'll do is that'll let me start like living there in peace, and people will think, oh, it's already been raided. Well, no need to go in there. And the only people who really go in there will be people who are noobs. And they won't have the resources to blow up my door. Yeah, I like that idea, actually. Huh. I might do that. Oh, this is a fully... Hello. Yeah, this is a this is a fully operational base with um, some fully operational folks in it. Um, yeah. Hope you don't mind me taking your stuff, bro. Well, what little stuff you have. Looks like someone else already had their way with your body, so... Yeah. You know... He's called PvP. We're not gonna do it. 
We're not gonna do it. I'm a, I'm a nice guy. I'm, I'm too nice for that, okay? We're not gonna do it. I know he's called, he's called PvP, but... It's just... You, you, you can't, can you? It's just so you feel like an asshole. Here's another fella who just started out. Hello. What you got? You're called Philip J. Fry. Okay, so it looks like we are relatively close to the starting area then. Like, literally right on top of it. There's that frozen lake again. Stay away from there. I'm gonna head over this way and hopefully finally find somewhere where you can sleep. Huh. This is adorable. <laughs> oh, that's cute. <gasps> oh my god, that's like the third time we've had a very close call with a bear. Fuck. Okay, we're gonna keep our gun out here. Where'd he go? There he is. That's a piggy and a bear. The piggy and the bear, 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 bear. Okay. Hi, dear. Hope you don't mind me just running by here and going, bunk. Give me my arrow back, you bastard. <laughs> I can't believe we found this guy. It's amazing. All these, like, buildings, everything that we come across, every structure is just, like, hours of work that someone has poured into crafting a base, crafting a home that someone else just come over and blown up because, because they can. It's actually quite sad when you think about it that way. Huh. I feel bad. I'm glad I didn't kill those people. Now that's a base. Wow. Has it been raided? Hang on. This is the base of people who don't make friends. We're gonna to wanna to be careful around here because I feel like at any time they'll just pop out and take a pot shot at us. What's this? DDW. No idea what that means. Oh, hello. There's an entrance. Hey, hey, beam. Okay, can't get up there. Dang it. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we found our temporary base. All we need to do is craft a door. Slap it on, and I reckon this place will do pretty well. It's basically already fully reinforced. All we need to do is make sure that it looks like it's still being destroyed. Wall off this little bit here. So, I just wall off all this. Let's see. We have a building plan. Uh, let's kind of show you what I mean. So, wall off this, this, and this. Maybe, like, a little bit further. Slap a door on this side here. Like so, just slap a door on there and then put a little stairway going up, which will cover up the the uh, cupboard. And we can live on the, this sort of area. Or even live on an upper floor and replace this cupboard and like put it up, put it upstairs. Yeah? Yeah. Cool. Okay. I, I kind of feel like that is a good plan. So, yeah. Well, on that note, we are going to wrap up this episode here. Thank you, guys. So much watching. What do you think of my little plan here to sort of live on the upper floors of this fully reinforced, pre-fully reinforced, I might add, base? We're going to fill it up with doors and live in here safe and sound, at least for now, until we figure out what we're going to do with the rest of our karmic sort of ways. So, <laughs> and bear in mind, when we die, series is over. Hang on, I hear something. When we die, series is over. So as soon as we die here, that's it game over not going to pick it back up and yeah so thank you guys so much for watching if you liked it be sure to like subscribe and all that fun stuff and i'll catch you guys in the next video whatever i make Bye bye